All right, let's check in with meteorologist Elise Smith and uh, Oh, you were out tonight. Did you see any grapple out there? Uh, a little bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had an umbrella that I was carrying <laughs> around, Elise, and it was really chilly downtown. It was, and with temperatures right where they were at, it really depicted what you got. You either got the grapple, you got sleet, we had rain, we had snow, and sometimes we had all of it falling at the exact same time. But from here on out, the forecast is clearing out. We've been a bit cloudy the past few days, but the next five are much sunnier. Tomorrow is going to start off partly cloudy. We'll have some clouds throughout the day, but high temperatures will reach the upper 40s, which is going to be much warmer than what we had today. Then for the weekend, 50s. Very nice fall weekend ahead. Perfect weekend to check out some fall colors, but let's go over what's happening right now. Here's the thing. Temperatures, as you can see, they are within that freezing range between about 32 to 36 degrees. It's 36 in Buffalo, 35 up in the falls. We are in the low to mid 30s across the southern tier and where your temperatures are is going to show what you're going to get from the sky. Here's what I mean. So you can see here on the radar, the radar is picking up on a true wintry mix. This band of lake effect showers that is moving from west to east, moving through uh, Lake Erie Beach, Hoover Beach, up to Hamburg, Orchard Park, just south of Blaisdale now and into East Aurora. So I would guesstimate that we are seeing likely rain falling from that one little cell could have some snowflakes with it as well. Also some grapple with the trend we've seen today. Now down across the southern tier, we are starting to clear out out, you see that and that trend is going to continue as high pressure begins to build into the region. So tomorrow is really a transition day. This high pressure system will move in. It will really take hold of the forecast and that's what's going to bring us this beautiful weekend for Saturday and Sunday, Sunday, mostly sunny <laughs> both days highs in the lower 50s. Chilly mornings though. Remember we are into well into fall, so temperatures starting in the upper 30s, but nice mild and sunny afternoons, sunny on both days. Go out and enjoy them and enjoy the peak fall colors that we're going to see here in Buffalo and Niagara Falls as well. But here we go on future look. I would say a stray lake shower possible overnight tonight, but by tomorrow morning we'll wake up to some fog across the southern tier, but then we will clear out after that. That was eight o'clock moving into tomorrow afternoon. You can see much more sunshine, much less cloud cover on future look right now into tomorrow night. We keep that clearing trend with us. We start to see that high pressure system really take hold. This is Saturday at 11 o'clock. Absolutely beautiful day. What a first weekend in November. We'll see sunshine highs in the 50s. Remember, mornings get pretty chilly, but that trend will continue into next week. So we had below average temperatures to start the month, but next week is going to be the exact opposite with above average temperatures.